Let's get to know the features of your new sewing machine. Now, all sewing machines are different, but they also all have some things in common. And once you know what those basic things do, you can more easily operate your machine. My machine is a Baby Lock Brilliant. It's a computerized machine, but your machine will have most of the same features. We're going to start on the side with the hand wheel. The hand wheel can go forwards or backwards and it will turn, it will move your needle up and down, just like that. Next, coming down on the side, all sewing machines will have a power cord and an on off switch. Sometimes your power cord will be connected with your presser foot cord, but mine has a separate input for the presser foot. But sometimes your cord is just going to go into one junction and then your cord, your power cord and your presser foot cord will be together like that. But that's, there's really not much to know about hooking the power up to your sewing machine except plugging it in and turning it on. Coming over here, you have your place to wind your bobbin thread. You have your needle thread and you have your bobbin thread. After your machine is all threaded, you'll want to input the type of stitch. Now, all sewing machines are going to have a straight stitch and a zigzag stitch. You're also going to be able to change the width of your stitch and the length of your stitch. And we'll talk about why that's important in another, in another video. But to recap the basics, you've got your power over here with your on off switch, your hand wheel that will turn the needle up and down. You have your needle thread. You have your bobbin thread and you have your stitch selector, which all you would need to know for right now is your straight stitch and your zigzag stitch. Now all sewing machines are going to thread their needle and their bobbin just a little bit differently. So the best way to learn how to thread your machine is to find a YouTube video. Um, so if you have a Baby Lock Brilliant like I have, just search Baby Lock Brilliant Thread Machine. If you have a brother, search that. If you have an Eversome, search that. If you have a Singer, search that. And you'll learn pretty quickly and easily how to. So I have two challenges for you. First, identify all the features of your sewing machine and I've got a Google form that you can fill out if you want me to revise it. And second is to find a video and thread your new machine. And once it's threaded, you can send me an image of your machine all threaded and we can move on to the next part of learning how to use your new sewing machine. Happy sewing!